Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I am bringing you some extreme cleaning motivation. I spent hours today cleaning my entire house and I wanted to bring this video to you guys to encourage you, give you some motivation to do some cleaning around your house. I'm going to be starting off with doing a little grocery haul. I went to Walmart this day. I got a ton of groceries that I need to go ahead and put away. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys everything that I got. Like I said, I went to Walmart. I spent about $200 this day on some groceries. We have been gone for about two weeks, so I kind of had to like kind of stock back up. We have a lot of food out in our motorhome, but we are deciding to keep it out there because we are um, heading to the races now every like two-ish weeks. So there's no point of bringing like everything in and then out and then doing all that kind of stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I got from the grocery store. Go ahead and give you guys a little grocery haul. All of this cost me probably $160. I did pick up a pool for Evelyn for about $30. So start over here. I got two loaves of bread. Joel eats the honey wheat. I ate just regular. Got some honey wheat pretzels. Two things of these mashed potatoes. We have not tried these yet. We're obsessed with this kind. So figured I would get this as well. I got some Spanish rice. Some American cheese. And then Evelyn needed some new um, forks and spoons. And then picked up a few things for her. We got these little sunglasses and this little purse. This was inexpensive. I think this is only like $5. But we've been wanting to try sunglasses on her. So hopefully she wears those. And then I picked her up this little red onesie um, for race day. If you guys don't know, my husband is a professional uh, motocross racer. So... His colors are red, so I picked that up, and then I found these really, really cute pajamas for her. They're like the peach theme for summer. These were 3T, but they looked really, they looked a lot smaller. Like, these will definitely fit her perfectly. I feel like, I don't know if they're marked wrong. It says 3T, but they definitely do not look 3T. They are, they will fit her perfectly right now. And she's only like 20, 20 months, so. Then I got um, some cheese ravioli for dinner one night, some mixed fruit for our smoothies, some crushed pineapple because I was watching um, Ellie Meekum's video from Jared and Ellie and she made like a teriyaki pineapple chicken. I really want to try that for dinner one night. She put it over rice and it looked really, really good. Then I got a pack of peppers, my chai tea latte. Everyone always asks me about my um, chai tea lattes that I drink in the morning. So this is the uh, box of them. Next, I got Evelyn some frozen Kraft macaroni and cheese. I'm talking quietly because for some reason, when I pull the camera out and talk, she throws a fit. She's over there watching a show right now. So I'm trying to talk quietly. Then I picked up this salad for me. It looked really, really good. I'm going to throw some chicken in it for lunch. Joel's obsessed with these little crystal light packets. He likes the raspberry lemonade kind, so I got him those. Evelyn loves these yogurts. In the morning, I will put this in a bowl and cut up some fresh fruit, and she'll have like a little fruit bowl, yogurt bowl for breakfast. Then we got some cookie or chocolate sweet cookie dough, pop tarts, chocolate fudge. Then we got a pizza, some asparagus, Cheetos that we dug in to in the store. <laughs> got some olive oil. Got some bananas, some pierogies. Absolutely love these. Let me know down in the comments if you guys know what pierogies are. I picked up some bananas for Evelyn, some rotisserie um, seasoned chicken breast. Some of these, we make chicken sandwiches with these for lunch and they're super good. I got two of these for her. She's currently eating one right now, but she's obsessed with these. I got her some strawberries. Some barbecue chips, polycrylic paint because give you a little sneak peek, but I'm painting our dining room table white. So I got this. Got some dinosaur nuggets for lunch, some chicken for um, the salad that I have. I have to get frozen fruit snacks wherever we go. Some cheeseburgers. We were out of ketchup. Some popsicles, which Evelyn already had one. Corn on the cob, three packs of chicken for dinners, hot dog buns, and some rice. And I think that is everything that I, I think I covered everything, but this is what we got from the food store. 
So now I'm gonna go ahead and put it away. I want to be daring, baby, dance the night away. I let my head down if I won. Don't you just get tired chasing fame and being pretty all the time? Doesn't sound like fun. You can do better. Let me show you what a good time looks like. You can do better. So much better. It wouldn't be a cleaning video if I was not doing some dishes. I swear, I just, I do dishes all day long, every single day. But that's what you get for having a little toddler and a husband who eat like crazy, especially my husband being a professional athlete. He eats all the time. So always doing some kind of dishes in my house. But sorry about the lighting right here. I'm not sure what was going on. It wasn't even sunny outside today. So I'm not sure why the lighting is so crazy. It might've been like the camera being messed up or something, but I'm gonna go ahead and clear off the island, wipe it down, get it all ready just to be nice and clean. I'm gonna go ahead and do a little um, diffusing. I think I diffused citrus fresh orange and stress away yes those are the three that i diffused this day and it smelled so so good Porch sipping on the rocks, citrus in our beverages, citrus in our beverages. Show only the good sides, always pretty smiles are covering our faces. You know it is all lies, you know it is all lies. On and on and on it goes, round and round the rodeo. Breathing out air for a minute, taking my time to begin with. On and on and on it goes, swing it down. So in the beginning of the video, um, you might have caught me hanging the hook on the window. If you guys seen my summer clean and decorate with me, I'll have it linked if you haven't. But I was talking about the wreaths. I had this one hung up, but they kept falling. And one of my friends, um, Hope from Real Life Mama, suggested hanging the hook and like putting a lot of pressure on it and leaving it hung for like 24 hours before I go ahead and hang the wreath on it. So I'm going to go ahead and try that. I will let you guys know if it works or not, but it's driving me nuts that all my wreaths keep falling in my house. To get a little lost in everybody's bits. Why don't we all calm down? Why don't we all calm down? I think I'm the wrong size. Not enough room for everybody's egos. Why don't we all calm down? Why don't we all calm down? On and on and on it goes. Round and round. Everything is a bit, a little 
I've been trying to get this slide outside of my house to put it outside because it's nice out, but it doesn't fit through any of my doors. So I need to go ahead and have my husband try and take it apart or something so we can get it out the door and outside out of the house because it takes up so much room but i hope you guys are enjoying this extreme cleaning motivation video if you guys are cleaning something in your house today let me know down in the comments And it also wouldn't be a cleaning video without some real life. Look how messy my living room was. I'm Evelyn eats snacks on the couch when she watches her shows and there was just all kinds of random stuff in here. And I've been telling myself I'm going to get new couch cushions for like months now and I went to Home Goods. I looked there. I couldn't really find any that I liked. I looked on Target, but I don't know. I'm still looking around. I really need to get some because I'm over the pink and the snowflake put backwards pillow, but definitely going to go ahead and get some new pillows. I know I've been saying that forever now. Everything we need right here. Wine and burning chemistry. You and me. 
I've been noticing a ton of new subscribers lately, so I wanted to go ahead and introduce myself. My name is Carly. I'm a mama to a 20-month-old baby girl. We live in Pennsylvania, and I do cleaning content here on my channel. I also do motherhood, lifestyle, and some home decor. But if you guys enjoy videos like that, and if you're not subscribed, definitely hit that subscribe button. I've been getting so many new subscribers, and I'm so thankful. Thank you for clicking on this video and watching it. So I went into Home Goods the other day and I got this basket because I wanted to get something for the mirror because it looked like a little lonely on the wall. It just looked plain. I feel like it needed something, but I picked up this basket from Home Goods, like I said, and it was only $11, which is super inexpensive for a good quality basket. I decided to add a blanket and then some greenery in it. I got that idea from Amy Fritz. I talked about her in my last video. I just love her home decor and she gives me so many good ideas, but I also want to go ahead and get like a potted plant for the other side just to kind of balance it but let me know what you guys think about that basket being there if it looks weird or if you like it just let me know down below so next i moved into the bathroom and i'm just taking everything off the countertops then i'm using the um method bathroom cleaner to go ahead and wipe down the countertops let me know down in the comments if you guys like the video sped up or if you like it this slower paced for the cleaning i know i speed up some of like the dishes and stuff just because i don't want my videos to be repetitive but let me know down below what you guys like because i truly am interested and i want to do what you guys like So I also added this little tray to my bed. I put a little plant, some greenery, a candle, and my remotes on it just because we were always <laughs> losing the remotes. So I figured if I had a spot on the bed for them, they would stay there. And I think it looks really cute. I used to have that on my table with a tiered tray in it, but I think it looks really good on my bed. Next, I'm moving into our laundry room. I think this is the first time I'm showing it other than my like laundry room reveal video. 
but I'm going to go ahead, um, fold some clothes, put some new clothes in the washer, and then put the clothes in the washer in the dryer, and just do, do some laundry because, like I said, we had just gotten back and we have a ton of it. So last we are moving in to the playroom and as you guys can see this thing was trashed. I needed to do some extreme cleaning in here because Evelyn had taken out like all the books and all the toys and just kind of threw them all over the ground. But I hope you guys enjoyed this extreme cleaning motivation video. If you guys did make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you are not already and I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye!